and welcome back to my channel. It is me and it today I have the Fall China Glaze collection. This is called I Don't Give a Sip. And it's another coffee inspired collection. Uh, this is a collection of six polishes. I purchased mine from polishpick.com. They are available at other retailers so you can purchase from wherever you'd like to purchase them. They're available. I think that we actually have descriptions on the China Glaze website. So that's what we're going with, and let's get to the swatches. I don't really know if this is the intention, but my thought process when I looked at this was uh, different levels of coffee creamer and coffee. If that's the case, this first one is a little alarming, because it, it, it looks just like creamer. But <laughs> it's called Coffee First, People Later. And this is described as a creamy, frothy beige which is accurate. It's not a white polish. It definitely is a, a creamy beige color. This one didn't have the greatest formula. It did need three coats to be completely opaque. Um, I feel like it it didn't really level that well, but at the same time it was also a little bit thin. It didn't run down my nails or anything like that, but it was just a little bit thin, and it wasn't my absolute favorite, but it also wasn't terrible. I just, you know, I would choose a different cream over this one. But that is three coats of Coffee First People Later. The second is called Hug in a Mug, and this is described as a caramel cappuccino colored lacquer with a silky smooth oat milk. So they're really going for this coffee thing. This one is a little bit of a yellowy color, like a yellowy beige color. Um, this one also needed three coats. The formula on all of these was a little bit thin. Not terrible formulas, but just a little bit thinner than I I think that we're used to from China Glaze. It's three coats of Hug in a Mug. The next palette is called Mocha Mama, and they look very similar in the bottle. I wish that there had been a little bit more variation between these, but they do look different on your nails. This one is described as a rich mocha hue. Um, I think that this is like a graham cracker color. That's what I, it reminds me of, like a graham cracker crust. Uh, this one also needed three coats. Formula on this was also a little bit thin. Um, I just didn't think that these covered very well, um, and so they, they all needed three coats, which isn't a bad thing, but the formula isn't as nice as it should be. But that's three coats of Mocha Mama. The next palette is called Caffeinated and Motivated. And this is described as a deep Columbia in a cup. That's what they're describing the colors. So, I mean, I don't really know what that means a medium brown cream polish. Again, three coats to be completely opaque, the same thin formula. Nothing that is like abysmal to work with, but they just all needed three coats, and that is caffeinated and motivated. The next palish is called Brew That, and this is described as a dark brown cappuccino color. This also covered in three coats, the same same formula. These all had the same formula, which, you know, I appreciate the consistency there, I guess. They all had the same formula, but it wasn't the best shiny lace formula I've ever worked with. This one needed three coats. I do love this brown color, and I love that these are all browns. There's no, like, mobs in it. I do love that. But the formulas leave a little bit to be desired, so that is brew that. The last polish is called My Broomstick Runs on Coffee. <laughs> and this is a rich, bold, brown-black color that requires no milk, no sugar, or cream to sweeten things up. So to me, this looks like plain black coffee. This one also needed three coats. You know, I, I didn't mind needing three coats for this as much because in my mind, again, I was thinking this is coffee. It's like, it's coffee, you know, it is thin. I do love this color, it is very pretty. It is a blackened brown. It does look brown on your nails, but I can also see how in, you know, you might think, is that black or is it brown? It, it, this is a beautiful color though, um, and that is three coats of my broomstick runs on coffee. That is the I Don't Give a Sip collection by China Blaze. What are your thoughts? 
I I think my broomstick runs on coffee is my favorite um, and like I said the formula isn't bad they're not like the worst polishes to work with they're not even bad to work with but they all needed three coats and they just felt a little bit thinner than that nice china glaze formula and, you know this is a fine fall collection I like that it's all creams I love brown nail polish so I'm always excited to add more to my collection so you know not my favorite but I don't hate it let me know what you guys think of this collection are you going to purchase any of these have you purchased any of these I'm very curious to see what their holiday collection is going to look like I imagine we'll be seeing that soon. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will talk to you in my next video.